I'm Robin from Star Trek Dark Armada and I'm here to join the cast of Convergence, a new Star Trek production by Sam, you. We met somewhere mm -hmm. in the middle of last year and you said, well, we talked a bit about productions and uh, stuff you wanted to do and we, we, we started talking after that and suddenly you came with this idea to do a, a crossover with Nick and uh, I said, yeah, Nick, we've always been thinking about doing a crossover, something together and and this was a good time to start that so of course i said yes well the, the script seemed pretty big but um since it's all green screen and you can play a lot with the, with the shots and the angles it was doable i know some scripts are doable if you keep it green only and um, yeah a lot of captain shots and crew shots and you can stick them all together and you have a film, yeah. <laughs> so, I knew it was doable, but um, I knew that um, you wanted to film this in two weekends, or at least most of this uh, you wanted to do in one weekend with four of the captains here. So that seemed ambitious. But I'm, I must say now, today is Sunday, the, the last day of the shoot, the first shoot, um, we did pretty well. But uh, Jim uh, isn't here yet, so his shots were uh, we have to record later. Um, but I'm quite confident it all we will all be finished when uh, the second shoot ends. It's it's fun to see that um, from a script uh, it turns into uh, reality when when everyone is here and they do the lines and it's funny and it's uh, you have a laugh and. Everything comes together and it's it's fun. It's fun to do, and that's that's the most important thing that we all enjoy uh, what we're doing because it's it's a fan production. So we've had to fly in for this one, and uh, Nick as well, Jim as well. Um, so it's a lot of it's costing a lot more than um, uh, than the regular Dark Armada production. So yeah, that's uh, that's a thing. So that's why we're doing um, an Indiegogo for this one, a little a little one to to make it. Uh, doable. Doable, yeah. I've been playing Richardson for, for like 10 years or so. Most of the times uh, I've also written the scripts uh, with a few pointers from other, other people as well. Um, so it's fun to see someone else writing that character uh, after watching the episodes and, and getting it right. For the most part, for the most part. Having that as a basis and um, having the opportunity to make a few tweaks and get the character exactly like it should be. Yeah, that's fun, that's fun. And um, it's good to see um, um, that another writer or producer understands the character um, and uses it the right way in, in a film. So it's good. And I think um, Richardson has a good place in it, uh, the place he should be having it's a it fits it fits his character and I think the same counts for uh, for Nick Cook as well his character uh, Daniel Hunter yeah Chris was amazing uh, very loud voice <laughs> he really blasted the two of us away Nick and me <laughs> literally <is that laughs> literally <one? laughs> yeah so yeah that was fun they were they were amazing amazing actors so we have a, an amazing group um, and, and I must say, when I, when I do a shoot uh, with Dark Armada, we have a lot of, um, a lot of less experienced actors. And uh, some, some lines, some scenes take more time than others. But, but this, uh, this shoot has been pretty, pretty fast, pretty good. So everybody knew their lines, everybody practiced a bit and just a lot of one-takers. That's amazing. Yeah, it's it's pretty amazing to get uh, to get access to pieces of of, of the Renegades production and and uh, having watched them uh, myself and even donated to the production as well. Uh, it's pretty cool to see uh, that they are okay with loaning a few of their ships and characters. So that's pretty awesome. So it's a really a, a crossover event bef between five uh, five fan films, and that's I think that's never been done before.